In this video, I'm gonna show you this really awesome technique where you can add your text behind a building right inside of Adobe Photoshop. So let's get right into it. So once you're inside of Adobe Photoshop and you have a photo on the canvas, you're ready to begin. And to begin with, we first want to start by making some text. So we'll go to the T icon on the left of Photoshop. We'll select the canvas and we'll just type out some text that we want to add. So in my example, I'm just going to put text effect in Adobe Photoshop or text in Adobe Photoshop. We're going to select all of this. We'll increase the size and then we'll change the color to black so we can see what we're doing. Now I'll pull this over to the very middle of the canvas. And now from here, I'm just going to zoom into the part of the text that is overlapping the building. We'll select the background layer, so that's the original image. Turn the padlock off so we can unlock the layer. Then we'll go up to the polygonal lasso tool and we're just gonna draw a mask around the part of the building that is currently being covered by the text. So as you can see, I'm only choosing this one small part of the building. Now, once you've drew that mask, you just wanna hold Command C on your keyboard to copy this and press Command V to paste this into a separate layer. And we'll drag that copied layer up onto the very top of Photoshop. And as you can see, that text is perfectly sitting behind the building. Let me give you another example of this. We're gonna go ahead and create a brand new text layer. So we'll go to T, we'll type out the word text. We'll increase the size of this to around 90 pixels. We'll pull this down and position this on top of this building here. Now we'll go back to the original layer. So that's layer zero, that's the background layer. Select the polygonal lasso tool and we're just going to draw around that part of the building that the T is covering. Now, once again, we're going to hold command C to copy, command V. We're going to drag this to the very top again. And there you go. The text is perfectly sitting behind the building. And if we move the text around, as long as it doesn't go out of that part of the building that we just copied, then it will perfectly sit behind the building. It's a really quick, it's a really simple, it's a really easy effect. And that is how you hide text behind a building right inside of Adobe Photoshop. And there you go. If you enjoyed watching this video, then please do let me know in that comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe, check out the previous video, and I will see you tomorrow for another brand new video. See you there.